Now, experts with Japan's Environment Ministry are trying to figure out how to satisfy the country's appetite for energy. They say a significant reduction in greenhouse gas emissions can be achieved through the increased use of renewable sources. The government's midterm target calls for emission cuts of 25% by 2020. Government leaders said after the accident at Fukushima last year that they wanted to reduce reliance on nuclear energy. They said they wanted to mitigate climate change at the same time. They asked their panel of experts to come up with new measures and review the midterm target. The panel estimated how much 1990 levels of greenhouse gas emissions could be cut by 2030. The experts say that even without relying on nuclear energy, a 25% cut in emissions is possible by significantly increasing sources of renewable energy and employing measures to conserve energy. And then the next commercial is this buzz for you. Come on everybody, let's be hypocritical bastards. Japanese government ministers say reactors at a nuclear power plant in the west of the country need to be restarted. They say that's the only way to avert a power shortage in the region this summer. The reactors at the OE nuclear plant are offline for regular safety checks. Ministers said a safety action plan from the plant operator meets new government standards. Here's your brain, here's your brain on drugs, just say no. Why do you think they call it dope? They also considered the likely power shortfall if the plant stays offline. The government is responsible for ensuring a stable power supply. We decided that the reactors at the OE plant need to be restarted. The minister said they'll discuss the issue again after getting consent from communities near the plant. It really was done at a high level, especially the CG piece. Mr. Hayashida is surprised. Yes, I am a professional myself, <laughs> but most people wouldn't doubt it at all if they were told that a professional had made this. <laughs> 